Well, thank you very much for the invitation and for welcoming me in Oman. Uh, I think this is a very great meeting actually and it's a great opportunity. And I think it's one of the very nice and good initiatives that will contribute a lot to the region. Actually, the meeting is uh, selected some experts from the region in the field of epidemiology and surveillance and outbreak response. And uh, um, we are discussing to develop a curriculum for rapid response training that will be uh, conducted very soon as part of the initiatives that's conducted by Infinite in the region. And uh, we are taking in our consider during this uh, the context of the region, the countries of the countries, and how we can do it in a practical way. As you, are, as you know, I'm, I'm working in the, in the same field, which is outbreak response and um, uh, controlling outbreak and going to the global uh, um, more about the complex emergency and, every, uh, and whatever is going in that dilemma. So uh, I think having rapid response team developed and uh, trained in a proper way, uh, taking in our consideration all the context of the countries and all the context of the region and uh, the capacity that needs on the field, uh, it's, uh, it's going to contribute very much to my work and to my colleagues that who are going to receive this training and who will be working with me, inshallah, in the future. Yes, because uh, most of the time we are adopting trainings from different agents, which uh, could be national or international. But this one is taking into consideration our uh, country's specific issues, uh, our levels of administrative, our capacities of our cadres that we are having, and they are working with us in the region or in the rapid response team to compete this kind of uh, outbreaks or events. Definitely after we finalizing the curriculum, we need to endorse it from the countries who are uh, members in the, re in the Infinite Network. And then I think we, we can do like a pilot in one or two of the countries in the region to see how does it work or do we need to do any modification or update on it. And uh, for sure then we can take it further steps and do training. <laughs>